Hello and welcome back to Darkwood Alpha 8.1. Today we're gonna go off to the village and see how far we can get in it without too much effort. This is just so many bear traps in this place. I did quickly check beforehand whether or not we could make any Molotovs and uh, apparently I drank all of the alcohol that I had so the answer to that was no. No, we can't. Another knife. Okay, with that though, I will take I will take the extra knife. I th um, although I did check, and one of the overarching reasons that we would probably want to try heading into the village, this is such a big thing, um, is that we probably don't have gas for the night. Probably. Alright, it's probably up. Um, just, you know, we're, um... We have maybe a night's worth, if that. And that's just a place, situation that I do not want to be in. Oh, come on. Ah. Blood killed it. Do I have any health items? No. Fantastic. Well, let's just go try and take on friggin' Black Chomper with like half health. That'll, that'll, I'm sure that'll go well. What is this? Just a backpack. Okay. Can I come in through here? This thing? No. I know there's a dog in there, and I know there's like a chest over here. Ah. Please tell me that didn't just go. Ah, oh, you asshole. Oh well. We have more. Can I make health? No. Yeah. Hey. Please go away. What is this patrol route? Ooh. So it goes all the way down here. Oh, I don't have a lockpick. Maybe we can just navigate our way around it. It's my hope. Pretty sure it'll take like one or two hits. And we're screwed. I think it's over there, yeah, okay. Don't come down here? Where do you go over there? Mushrooms up there at least. Is it just was once a hideout, I guess. Uh. Okay. Oh, some more? Kind of, not really. <laughs> ah! What? Ah! Motherfucker. Oh, come on! Really? I didn't even know those chains could snap. The chains for that chomper didn't snap. What makes you so special? Ugh. Uh, I really need wood. I need to repair this thing. I guess I'll just cook the meat that I have then. Why not, right? I have it. It's here. And I'm here. Okay. Doop. We're almost there. At least we're at full health again, right? Yeah. So that's the one benefit of dying, I guess. 
I gotta get better at the combat. The this thing is a little weird to use though. It'll take me some getting used to. Swamper. It's an understatement for what that thing is. It's pretty good on land too. Alright. So let's see. Can I interact with this at all? Ah! What? Well, aren't, aren't you aggressive? Jeez. And now I'm out of... I'm out of... Uh, I need gasoline. I need gasoline real bad. Down. Down is the direction we want to go. I guess that was a good ploy on them, though. It's a doghouse after all, so... Oh, hello. Wait, wait. Take your time. I really wish I knew where it was that it... Stopped. It goes off somewhere over there. Hello, stuff. The sound in here is a little creepy, too. Correctly, it comes. Gets close to this. So many mushrooms. Lockpick door. Flares, eh? It's back here somewhere. Yeah. Pretty well. Alright. <sighs> what could go wrong? What could possibly go wrong? Hey, what are those? The crown of a huge three through the small window. I'm sure that's what could what could possibly be the problem with that. Another corpse. Hey, a sickle. I do welcome this. Oh, and pliers! Yes, I can upgrade my thing event finally. Gotta be careful. Uh oh. Hope it doesn't attract them or something. I just want to light this up. No? No. Oh. I guess I should put some kind of accelerant on it, but I don't really have one. Just only it only feels like we're going deeper into the nest of something. Uh huh. You're alive. <sighs> and then reaches out with his hand, trying to reach me. You're not from around here. You cannot be. Everyone is dead. It's only me. And he finally reaches my hand and grabs it. For a moment, he sits in silence, clutching my hand. I hear him mumbling something under his nose. I've got nothing. There is nothing left. I've only this chair. His gaze stops somewhere under the ceiling of the barn. What? He suddenly jumps back. What's that? His long fingernails digging into... feels long fingernails digging into my hand. It's not a fucking tree. 
Looks like one, but those faces. I know them, each one. All of them are familiar to me, and all are fake. They are not real. I thank God I can't see anymore and don't have to look at them. The old man lets go of my hand to lean against the back of the chair. It disgusts me, this filth. I constantly hear its pathetic mumbling, as if I were to believe it's human, as if it's my Anushka. He reaches his arms towards me, almost falling down. He grabs me by the coat and arm. I feel all his weight on me. You, you have legs and arms, strong arms. Please, I beg you, get rid of that filth from my village. I can't bear another he day hearing the sobs of that abomination. I want to die in peace. I want to at least die in peace. Listen to me. I've thought about this. I had a lot of time to think. The old man's eyes widen. His pupils are milky white. I can feel him climb my coat. You need to find the basement. Yasiak's basement. I remember it. It's just next to the tree. The tree is too big. You won't get through it. The roots need to be in the basement. Its roots need to be in the basement. It's obvious. Destroy them. You will find a way. I know you will. He slides down my coat straight into his destroyed wheelchair. For a while, he searches for his stone, on which he finds about his balance. Thank you. Thank you. I haven't done anything with you yet. It used to be different here. First, the woods changed. Trees started growing everywhere. We were cut off from the rest. Suddenly, the water came and flooded our fields. Then, the hunger. People did stupid things. That's how we ended up here. If you stumble across some wheels, two little wheels so I can fix my chair, maybe you could get something in return? Okay, cool. What's that? The old man leans towards me. The wheelchair? The war took my legs. Then those sons of bitches burned down my pigs and cottage. Said a disease was spreading there. So they said. Then the disease took my Anushka. All I have left is this wheelchair and this land. Years ago, when my sight was good, people used to come by. They came out of their houses and went over there, where that damn tree is standing. Sometimes they disappeared during the night, so no one could see them. Sometimes during the day. They went there, into the dark wood, and never came back. Hmm. So this is going, something's been going on for years? Or... Or is it just, um... Or is this, like, some kind of, um... Because it almost sounds like people are... It's just people escaping during the night. So maybe this is like Nazi occupation or something? Some said, although not many, as most were silent, that they were going back... That they are going back home. I don't know. Our land has changed. The trees have cut us off from the rest of the world. But home, for me, is here. Maybe the forest set them free. I don't know. Then that monstrously, that monstrosity, that abomination grew up from the ground and everything changed. Brock blocked the way, and no one came this way ever again. I guess now it repeats. Hmm. Maybe the woods... What does he say? Uh... What did he say? Okay. So they disappeared in the night. They said they were going back home. forest set them free. I don't know. Hmm. So has there always been something weird about this wood? Oh, great! This is like right next to where I need to be, I think. To get out. And not suffer too much. Although I don't remember over this. Oh, okay. So this is I'll get, I'll get here for the tree. I know. I have something I need to do first, though. What? I need half a shovel. Oh, okay, so you, I could also have been... come around to here, apparently. So how does this work? Hold on. I just want to confirm, because it is getting a little bit late. I want to confirm that I can actually get out before you leave. Please see if you can do something about the tree. I will do something about the tree, but right now I'm not really equipped to do much of anything to anywhere. All right.
right, okay. So this is all linked together. Did I ever go in here? No. Interesting. Ooh, a corpse. Did we loot it? Nope. Mushrooms? Yes. Good. Talking tree, right? I remember. Something like that in the little interlude area. Alright, I'm gonna go over there first. Check out what this is. Is there anything interesting over here? This is what I mean by... Oh, whatever. I did get some leather though, so that's nice. I guess. Do I want to go? I feel like I want to go this way. Nope, nope. That could end badly. Very badly. Very quickly. Nah, here we go. Yeah. Yeah, okay. We did it. Alright, so there's the basement next to the tree. 
We gotta go there. Oh, okay, that's just a huge dog that I just killed. I was like, hey, a corpse, that's weird. That wasn't there before. It's true, it wasn't, until a moment ago, when I murdered it. Man, that's right next to the hideout. Alright. Yep, we got enough for the night. I found no additional um, gas, which makes me very upset. I was hoping these would be gone. <sighs> what do I do about them? I don't know. Hopper upgrade, sure. What else am I to do with it? Oh my god, that's so terrifying. <laughs> what do I need to upgrade the workshop? Okay, I have 18, I need 18 nails. Which, oh, I'm gonna have to give it up for today. Oh my god, they're still here. Why are they still here? Is this one still there? Great. Uh, I really hope they're just bugged and I don't have to worry about them. That would sort of be the best case scenario. I thought there was a figure standing there. Alright. There we go. There we go. What? Nobody saw you? What are you doing? Oh, okay. He's, it's coming back up. Uh, is it nighttime? Damn it! I'm gonna have to abandon the. This might not make it through the night. I have a lot of stuff. I don't know what I'm gonna do with the old sickle. I guess I can repair it and give it to the three. That's kind of probably the best thing I can do with it. Flares! I'm gonna stick you in here. Uh, I don't need that extra one, that's for sure. These can go over to the thing next time. I'm gonna go ahead and get the two knife thing going. Alright. So yeah, if you came to chapter 2, I don't think you get the bike man. You'd have to remember to take the bell with you. Which is kind of fair in the, in the sense that um, you had to remember to take it to the hideout 3 as well, but I actually can't go back, which is why it feels a little bit cheap. I don't even know if it would work if you brought it over. That would be something to keep in mind the next time. Just make sure we take the bell with us. Oh great, this one. Don't want this one. Hey you. No. Oh, I almost want to go out and get it. But no, it's not worth it. I like how they crawl, um, I think they used to crawl under everything. Like they crawl under doors and stuff too. But now they've uh, they've made it so they only crawl under under the um, doorways, which is neat because they're bugs. They crawl under stuff. Oh no! And the there we go. I like how you kill the bugs and then a bunch of tinier bugs crawl out of it. It's just gross. I forgot about the well again. That's okay. There's something walking out there, and I really hate that that thing is there. I want to try and kill it. Maybe we should use this and see how it goes, but... Uh, maybe we'll try it during the time stop, because at least it seems like if we die during the time stop, it spawns us during the time stop, so... I really hope that none of them detonated anywhere over here, because that's going to be a pain. It's a 
dog. No. Did I see something over here? Was it just fog? Oh, hey, this light also flickers. That's cool. made it, probably. Relatively uneventful. Certainly could have gone a lot worse. because it still thinks they still think that I'm on day tree three or whatever. Cook, 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 quickly. Yes. Barely. Ah let's see. I don't know. Ugh. More health? More health sounds good. Seems like a pretty classic trade-off to make, too. Do more damage when your stamina is low. Interesting. I definitely want to make... I don't know. I'm not really using firearms, but I plan to be. Oh, no fever drain? Oh, that's... Oh, wait. 16,000? That's also attainable. We can definitely make that. 960. There we go. Good. Good. All right. Let's go turn off the generator. The usual, our usual ritual. Damn it. Get over there. And now we don't have any gas. So we definitely have to find some gas for the next day. Otherwise, we're uh, not in good shape. Let's put it that way. Yeah. I thought that I'd be able to... Well, okay, we can still do that, right? There's nothing that prevents us from... Like, I'm just gonna buy gas and one less thing instead of two things. <sighs> I can also get two planks of wood. But you know what? You know what? This is more important. No, oh, they'll take it. Ten. Hold on, how much does it take? So I can take two planks and some of the stuff that I already have to make this worth probably a hundred? That seems worthwhile. Let's do that. Great. And now we've got a gas, which means we're no longer screwed. So, yeah, I don't know. I'm just gonna dump it all in here. Because I need two and a half ticks per night. It just seems, it seems excessive. It used to be less, although I think that may have just been my impression because I would always get the... There used to be a skill that would let you use up... No, no, I want to go fix this thing. Hey, buddy. It's so... Uh, I don't want... Do not want... Do not want... That is all that is going through my head about that noise. I could also try to upgrade the thing. But first of all... Repair this. Yeah. And then we can uh, get that back. We have this stuff and a health item finally. Then, well, I'm almost tempted to sell them the old one instead, but. Mm, I'll sell them the old one instead. 87 reps, pretty good. No. What item will I have to show them eventually, I wonder? It's so good. I'm almost tempted to just immediately buy more gas, because that has been such a pain point this entire playthrough. Let's just do that. Okay. Is there anything else I want? Yeah, wood. I'll take all your wood. Just give it give it to me. Okay. Alright. I wanted all the
all the wood because I'm hoping to... No, I need more wood still. Damn it. Well, I can still use this to make more wood. Let's do it. Let's do it. Eleven. Twelve. Oh, it takes fifteen, not twelve. Come on. Just a little bit. There we go. Oh, man. Not enough room. No. Okay. Well, whatever. You can you can have this log back now. <sighs> Alright. Then Oh, I can do it. I'ma do it. Hooray! And we're maxed out now. We can make explosive barrels, the double barrel shotgun, which would be really great. That would make me feel safe around even black, the black chompers. Because it just, it would win, and I know it does, so... Yeah, the axe is a thing to shoot for. I think we can't do this anymore, can we? No. What, what does that other upgrade do? It doesn't seem like we'd be able to do anything with it, though. Either way, we at least have plenty of nails, so I'm gonna go ahead and partition out. Partition out the required amount of nails, which is, what, 20? Yeah. 20? And the rest are the ones we use for actual stuff. Get over here, come on. Can we make the armor? We don't have enough rags to make the armor. That's, that's just, that's so wrong. That is not a situation I should be in right now. Okay. Nails. That. No. No, wait. There we go. That makes sense now. I want this to happen as well. I don't know if I should keep these. T I guess we'll, we'll try one and see, you know, what happens. How, how good it is. Actually, let's do it right now. Right? We have these things. It said that before. I got some other th kind of thing from it. Well, gas certainly spread quicker than I would have liked, but on the other hand, it was also pretty effective <laughs> overall. So I'm gonna keep. Tell you what I'll do. I'll keep three of these around. I'm gonna go sell one of them. Because I'm only going to be able to make those whenever stuff rots. And I don't think that will be frequently enough, basically. So I'd much rather curry favor with them and buy stuff for when I need it. Oh man, that's so tempting to, to go for that. But, you know, it turned out that we could play it smart around the Black Chomper instead of aggressively. So that worked out, I guess. Um... Let's go in here and... It seemed like it didn't wake up though, so that bodes well, I guess, but yeah. Uh, sure? I don't know. I feel like there has to be one of those categories for like, these are things that aren't that important, but you'll have plenty of. Mm hmm I don't want to carry around two of those. Well, they're the only health item I have, so I will. If I had other health items, I'd definitely be carrying something else, but... Mm. Antidote... Let's go crash that out. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Come here. Nope. Well... I always feel a little bit disappointed when that happens. Let's cook... That. We're a decent ways towards the thing. There's meat everywhere. Here. There's even some that I didn't pick up over over in the um somewhere. I don't remember where. It's like a couple of things that I killed. But uh 
Anyway, let's see. What else is left to do with this inventory? We can put the gas away, I guess. And we could try to make more wood with it as well. Um, but you know what I'm actually going to do with that gas? I'm just going to dispense all of it. Just stick it all in here. Because like I said, running out of energy during the night, do not want. Although, to be honest, it is... I haven't had a Shadows event in a long time. So I don't know how worried I really should be about it. Like, if there's a better strategy involved where you, uh, you let it be dark and just use flares or something, you don't have to worry about it. Alright. Well, that's much better, right? We have... how much is this? Two days? Almost three days worth? Well, okay. It's a little ways into three days worth. That. That. I have plenty of space now, so that's good. Um, I am not at full health though, because I hurt myself, but... So let's see what happens if I... Okay. So those were just glitched out somehow. Hmm. I'm okay with that though, I just got some decent, decent haul. I now have enough to make a kind of, like, a rag health item thing. Which I welcome. Let's see, come on. I wonder if... Because I can drive this blackness away with the flashlight, right? I wonder if I can shine it on the black chomper? Can I do that? Is it worth... Is it worth risking is the real question. I don't know the answer to that. I don't really want to make light armor with it. I, I really want to make the bandages. Like, full stop. I want bandages. I don't want to have to rely solely on on those things. Alright. Phew. I also feel like I should repair this. But I don't have any wood, or hope of having any wood. And the village is one giant thing that I can't really interact with. So, all right. Well, let's let's see. I'm I'm hoping that this quest doesn't end it. Like that we can just we can go and do the tree thing and then we'll get to keep going for the rest of the stuff to do here cuz this place is somewhat large. There's plenty of locations and stuff to do. Come on. There's still a, a trap thing down here somewhere. Alrighty. And there's the fire. Need a key, huh? This also does, like, the... This thing doesn't last very long. It doesn't last very many hits. And I can't upgrade it, right? That's the weird thing. Alright, where's the basement? This thing? It's probably that thing, isn't it? This looks like it's probably it. Wardrobe? Uh, inventory of food. Six potatoes. 1986, 821. Jazik is dead. We're down to 26. Six potatoes, half piece of bread, two liters of gasoline, one potato. Jazix. Okay. They got his potato back. 822, five potatoes. 823, five potatoes and one dog. 826, three potatoes. 826, six potatoes. 825, three potatoes. Wait, why does it go 825 again? Is that... Are they going crazy? Or... One dog. Like, where did all this go? I guess it was eaten. Ah. Oh, excellent. I will actually be, um... Somewhat well-equipped for this. How do we do this? I want to have this... 
feel like I'll probably need the, um... There we go! Finally! Alright, is that it? Is that it? Alright, let's do it! It's blocked from the inside. It looks like someone tried to break it open. that you were saying? Inventory food. All sorts of things used to happen in our village. Sometimes a face got punched for some silly thing. A faint smile appears on the old man's face. But we always stick together. We had to. I sometimes hear the memory of those times coming from that tree. That thing won't let me forget. Okay. Hmm. So you have no opinion on it. I guess I'm going to go kick the tree. That is the only remaining course of action, really. Oh, hey, mushrooms! Are they, wait, I thought I collected those already. Are they back? not even sure that there is a backswing because it just sort of like it looks like when I hit something it will work the first time but that's it wasn't there somewhere to to dig or something examine again it's blocked from the inside it looks like someone tried to break it open all right so I have to figure out a way to get in there Probably not going to be even remotely as easy as it should be. Oh good, another one. There's a lot of those lying around it seems. Oh wait, oh that's the... Oh, there are two of them. Okay. Good. Good, good. my refrigerator. Okay. <sighs> I do not want to go here. I should have brought my spare battery. Is there anything else around here? No. by the roots. Walk in there, right? Okay. So let's see this. This seems like as good a place as any is to test this. Oh, good. Good. We squandered it. Excellent. Okay, so you're one of the people. Wait, I cut out a talking tree in the village whose roots brought me way back home. <sighs> so, we're one of those people that used to come back here and. and, uh. go home? 
One of the figures of the tree tried to show me something, but the overwhelming voices did not let me hear properly. Basement of the tree. Unfortunately, the basement is flooded and I cannot progress any further. Ah. Really making movement, just like someone is holding me by the ankles. Oh boy. Okay, cool. So it's just like him being like, oh, you ain't gonna make it. Oxygen tank, huh? Well, there's some rusty oxygen tanks over there. What's over here? Oh, good, and we just ran out of thing we need for it. Oh. It's only when it's visible, basically. Ow. Great. Nothing. Interesting. Why would it only be harmful if it's visible? Well, I guess now I learned something. It's only harmful if it's visible. I don't know, that kind of seems to relate it to this, those eye things as well, because they behave similarly. Alright, so I need an oxygen tank to get to the other side. I ain't got nothing to say about this, alright. Um, I do have health items. Actually, I have a bandage now, which I shall use. Oh wait, I could have made... Come here now. Come, I will. What's up? The basement is flooded, am I right? Everything is flooded here. The old man looks behind himself as if he was looking for something. What? Oh. Yes. Elephants! Have you seen the elephants? They live here, in the northwestern part of the Womp. Their cottage lies in a thick forest. What? This is the woods trapped us here. They keep to themselves. They don't like us, damned elephants. They do have oxygen tanks, however. Lots of them. If the basement is flooded, then an oxygen tank would be useful, yes? Elephants? The old man told me to go find the elephants if you provide me with an oxygen tank, which in turn shall let me travel through the flooded basement. I should be able to find them in the northeastern part of the swamp. Oh, man. Northeastern, right? So that's here? It's, a, it's northeastern, not northwestern, right? No, northwestern. Okay, so it is above the lake. Well, alright. If you say so. Fuck. You know what? Yeah. And I'm curious about that black jumper. Seems like the sickle has, like I remember I'd hit stuff and it would get stunned briefly. Seems like that doesn't happen with the sickle. Ah, oh well. 
Either way, I'm probably it's probably enough time to go and get my stuff back, so let's just go do it. Elephants, huh? That's just just such a weird designation. I guess I'm really curious about what that means. Like, who are the elephants? Why are they called that? I also think I don't know. We want to go up, explore up too, but. There's annoying things in the way. I think as far as south goes, though, there's not a lot left for us to do. some precious resources that though. Yeah, I don't know about the sickle. I don't know how I feel about it. Definitely leaning towards I might want to try finding something else. Uh, did we really explore as much as we could? Well, definitely not as much as we could because there's a bunch of stuff that we can't, uh, can't open. bunch of areas that are hard to find out if we can actually do anything in. I like how you can highlight still like see some of the stuff back here. It adds a little bit of a, a third dimension to it. Lockpick. Or I can just smash my way through it. That's another option. Definitely want to explore it at some point though. Okay, so now this is just a normal house hut thing. So, okay, that's fine. So at least that goes down and I can, you know, run over that. Where'd my watch go? I found my stuff, right? Do you lose something every time you die? There's the chomper. It killed me, I don't remember, somewhere over here. It was nearby, though. I didn't manage to actually get very far. Where'd my watch go? I remember I had a watch. Oh, okay, no, I do have it. It's just that that's still a bug. It doesn't always take. Alright, well, I want to find out what's in that chest. Find out what's in that chest. Oh my god. This is very inefficient. Holy crap. I really want the axe right now. Plus side, I think we'll have plenty of sickle left. Come on. Wait every time. I keep forgetting though that it doesn't actually cost stamina to charge it up. We're almost there. Uh, we'll waste one though. Climb, you fool. What's our reward here? Find out. Probably something good. Oh, that's not bad at all, actually. This is all pretty good stuff. Full tank of gas. Uh, bear trap. Hey, you. Come here. Come on. 
Is, there, is my knife still in here? I hope, I hope so. That would be nice, but yeah, I guess not. Alright, well, I'm just gonna murder you. My knife back, please. Thank you. Corpse with a battery in it. Sure. Poison shrooms. Otherwise, not a lot. Oh, a shelf. Sure. Alright, let's rush our way back then. Because it is getting pretty late. Alright. Damn it. Well, on the plus side, every time we do that, it means that we won't get to do it later. So, there's that, I guess. Small consolation. Also, now that I realize it, I've actually been doing this in the wrong order. I should always just rush in and cook, because that stops time. And then I can, uh, do, do the rest just from there. Right, because this stops time, so I can be like, great, we'll just deposit the things. Um, yep. There's no real reason to do inventory management now, either. But yeah, alright. I think we'll have just enough time to run down here. And, uh this off. Before we run up, get our sampling. Really? Right, it's a 45. 40. Hooray! Tiny smidgen of health. I don't know that that was the right choice. That amount of health almost doesn't matter. <laughs> Okay, well, we can do a little bit of inventory management while we wait. Um, do we have a lot of knives again? No, not really. This can stay here. I'm gonna sell that. Sell the shit out of that. Uh, meat? I hope I can sell. I don't really use the meat. Oh, 
That's great. So far, so good. I'm okay with this evening. Sorry, I'm talking too much, but I'm trying to think through. We have the elephant's goal, but we also have the junkyard to explore. We do have a gun now, although we only have one clip's worth of ammo, which is not really enough to make me want to rely on it too much. Um, I... There's something outside somewhere. A spider thing. It's fine. Come on. Oh, really? Oh, God. No, oh, man. That's terrible. It's awful. Man. I hate this thing. This stuff is the worst. It is tempting to, because they sell these as well, right? For what, 10? So for 16, I can make this worth 100 again. So, yes, let's do that. Or I guess it's 26. But I have, I don't actually need this, I have enough to spare myself. So, alright, let's do that. Oh wait, do they, do they take the meat? I think they do, yeah, that's good. It's not worth very much though. Whatever. I'm just glad they take it, because I don't want it. Alright, and then you, batteries, although if we're going to be walking around, I just feel like if I'm going to be walking around with one of these, I should have, they stack pretty well, a couple batteries on me. This makes sense, you know? Um, I have breath items, I have too many breath items, because you probably only really want one. And I'm going to go with the bread sell them the flashlight, because there's no reason to have more than one. Just a high value item. Man, I can get, I'll do it, I'll get at least one. One more. I did, don't, don't, don't do that. Alright. Um, that's what to do next. First, I want to take care of the ick. Just because it's easy. Right after I do this. This thing, or the, um, the pliers. I'm sure we'll get more pliers at some point. There was something that needed a shovel somewhere, so maybe we should devote this towards shovel. I'm sure we can find another stick too. Um, tape. I need to find that tape stuff again. 
So that's the thing. Yeah, I can't upgrade this. Okay, that must be it. Because I think this seems like it's probably about as powerful as a normal like with nails on average, but it's also a lot more fragile. So, eh, who knows? I'm not sure what the balance is on that. Mmm, yeah, that. Although I don't want all of them. I only want like three. No, just. Yeah, let's do four. Five. Five. Let's do five. Um. What do I need to make a Molotov? I kind of want to keep this here. So that I can make a Molotov one day. One day. Um, selling you, you can stay here, I need you eventually, yeah, alright, did this wrong though, there we go, now we can go deal with the ick, you're here, sell to you, what am I selling to you again, yeah this thing, cool, I am tempted to take all of your planks though, again, because if I have, if I have spare, well, hold on, how much do I have? 192? <sighs> I could take the extra bullets. That's certainly something. Uh, how close would I need? Uh, we're kind of close to that, actually. I could probably sell them enough nails. If I can get 50 out of the nails, and that would be enough. Just, does that work? Can I? Man, one by one, really? Knife, I think, is also worth 100, so that's good to know. Bear trap. Do I want to deploy that, or do I just want to convert it into scrap? Or, um. Or rep. I feel like I should deploy it. I've just, I've just had too many problems with with them before. Alright, first of all, well, no. First of all, this. Because this is just a liability. Don't worry, Blackness. I'm here. Cool. Whatever. My, uh... My little... fire image still seems broken. That's okay. I don't want to... I, for a moment it crossed my mind to test if will it set me on fire, and the answer is that that would just be a terrible thing to try and test. <laughs> like, that's just a stupid thing to try and test. I don't need to know. Um, I'm just tempted to deploy this solely because... I don't know, I've had problems in the past where there was, there was the thing running around in here. And I'm pretty sure that in practice I would just end up killing myself on it though, but we'll try it. Let's see. Let's see how it goes. Might as well try it, right? Oh right, and we have stuff to cook. Lots of stuff. Very high yield stuff to cook. Uh, 1280. Damn, that's a lot of essence. Am I doing... Uh, okay, so we want to have these two. We want to swap that one. I'm going to go ahead and put some of this into... Uh, into this. It's true that we're never really screwed gas-wise. As long as we survive the night, we can always... Um, can always just buy some. So if we're gonna be frank with ourselves, what we should be doing is just using the one that we find on other stuff, and then just buy some gas from the like instead of getting two mushrooms, get some gas and shrooms. But you know, or I can do both, like I'm doing now. Yep. I'm gonna deploy all of it. I wanna make a bunch of planks. I'm tired of being out of wood. Right, whatever, fine. 
16 is an excellent number of planks. Excellent number. There we go. Good. What can I do with it? I need almost all of them to upgrade the ship workshop if I want to do that. But I can also keep a little reserve for repairing stuff. What do I need for this? Uh, stuff I don't have. I'm gonna keep six in reserve for repairs. Um, jeez, so many nails. Right. Fifteen nails with me, that can go back. Um, do I want nine planks with me? I don't. I really don't. How about this? We'll put five towards this. And we'll take four with us for repairing stuff for now. And this is our repair fund. So we... Ah, cause I do want to try holding up in here instead. Is that broken? What? Why would you attack this doorway? What attack? Oh no. Okay, it's just hard to see. Because it just feels like it would be safer. I don't know why, though. Like, that place is plenty safe. It's got two windows and this thing that I've locked up. All those cracks that probably... I don't know that they've had any impact, though. This thing has this one open thing, this thing, an open gap here that I can't do anything about. At least that one, if I wanted to, I could, I could, um, board it up. Which I probably should have done. Would have helped against the dog that came in. I could close it. Whereas here, right, like, I'd just be bored. Unless I managed to do something there. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, it's to be closer to this, so that we can, like, have access to our items during the night. Rather than having to do it beforehand. But yeah. I don't know. Ah. I really don't have anything else to sell you. I would like to curry more favor with you. That's where I'd like to swap them. Sure. Alright, well. Fence. Why would I build the fence? Is that, is that useful? What does it take? More than I have? Which is all that's really relevant, but oh yeah, I also remembered I have a... I can build this thing, find out how big it was, let's do that. Yeah, it's a proper wardrobe too. Which means, I don't know, I am still waffling on whether or not it's worth... Like, is it really worth getting ourselves to be near this? Because this is kind of useless throughout the night. That's very true. It is completely useless. Um, but this place is pretty safe. Like, now that we've... Once we've got it like this, then... Uh, we, if we boarded that up, we would have a two-environment setup that's pretty much as safe as it gets. Like, stuff can break in, sure, but, you know, it's always a constant. Whereas here... There's three windows, which is a little bit more. Uh, I definitely would need to move this over there, just to not try to not trigger that thing during the night, because I still don't trust it. Um, we could put a wardrobe here to, to sort of deal with that doorway, and we'd need to put another one here to deal with this doorway, and that would leave us with a spare wardrobe do something here. Uh, maybe, right? Because I don't know that we, we want to leave it open most of the time, and if there is something in here, I don't know that the wardrobe's going to be of much help anyway. We could box ourselves in with it, maybe. 
Actually, that's a strategy that I haven't thought of in a while. I can shoot over those too, so in principle, like if something breaks in, I can just sort of crawl under the corner with that above me and use it as cover. I had never thought of trying to do that. I guess we'll try to do that at some other point. But either way, I don't think, I don't have enough, I mean I do have enough planks to probably get, accomplish a decent amount of stuff, but I don't want to use them that way right now. I definitely want to save up for that other upgrade, and I want to make sure that I can get to, um, that I can repair stuff when I need it, because that's come up way too often. So I think I'm just going to roll with this for now. And we'll see how it goes. I also want some rags, but anyway, um, hmm. well, there's still some exploring in the village to do because there's those lockpick areas. Lockpick, that's it, actually. Come here. I want something from you, something cheap. You know, yes. Sure, I'll take another one of those. Wire, there it is. Yeah, I'll give it. I don't need that. Hmm. It's expensive, but having a lock, extra lockpick is pretty good in, lower, in dark wood. So here we go. And I wanted the rags just because I'm tired of not having uh, alternative health items. I don't like using the pills because I can't craft them. So there's no way, and they're really good. So there's no way I could like. If I use a pill, then that's that. Like, I have to go find more pills, which, actually, do I have a lot of pills somewhere? And I'm not going to bother with dragging around the the wardrobes right now. I'm still not sure about what I want to do, and frankly, we're doing pretty well in here. It's been pretty safe, and I haven't lamented too many times needing to come over here in the morning instead of during the night. So I think I'm just going to stick with that for now. Um, you know, leave well enough alone and all that. But alright, I think we're set for the next day. I'm not really sure what I want to do. I'm a little bit excited to go try to find the elephants or explore the junkyard, but I think most likely I'm going to try heading back to the village and make sure I've explored everything because we, you know, there's at least one or two lockpick doors that we might want to use. And there is uh, the upper area that had one of those annoying, annoying lungy things that I hate and suck against. I just want to make sure that I've explored that thoroughly um, before moving on to the next objective. So I'll be doing that the next time. As always, thank you for watching, and I'll catch you next time.